state of the plants for today, this morning. Uh, rainwater side, it's looking pretty good. Leaves very healthy, very green. It's pretty big. There are two two sprouts remaining in here. I pruned out the rest. I think this is three in here. Yeah, I'm not very good with this camera thing. <laughs> uh, yeah, that's probably like three down in there. Two or three. All of them are at least two or three. I believe this is another two over here. Um, and then these two rainwaters. Sorry, uh, tap water. That's it. Keep calling them rain. These are three and three, and surprisingly, they are looking a little bit more wide or long leafed. At least the, the one on the left is. I'm not sure if that's because this is getting a, a more even sun exposure time. You can see this one in the corner here won't get any until the sun comes about at this position. I'd say that's about midday ish. Uh, this one gets it a little earlier and it's definitely reaching to the window here um, you can see these leaves here curling around that direction for the morning sun as if they're not really getting anything for long periods um, so I, I'm gonna have to see if I can refine the experiment next time uh, try to get a more even conditions across the board but uh, I'm still surprised that these um, these tap waters are doing so well. Uh, it's it's hard to separate and tell at the moment which is which. I mean, visually, these leaves are more open on the for the left hand pot, and the right looks a bit more curled up. Yeah, that trace is down in there. A bit more uh, squeezed together. Not sure what to make of that. Uh, the third pot died, and well, they put something else in there, so ignore that. Um, yeah, a little bit on the hydroponics if anyone's interested. The leaves were really pale. Uh, one I had put only the tropic grow in and left it, uh, so I switched out to plain water again. This didn't improve much. Uh, this is all rainwater, but then I uh, I used some uh, some information on the internet to mix up a a different a different batch of uh, a more balanced batch of nutrients from a wide range of fertilizers I had here laying around, and it's taken on. It looks like they got back their color. You can definitely see a difference now because there's a mottling of the leaves. Don't know if you can see that there. Uh, yeah, I'm not sure if that's the color coming back in patches or if that's another sign of uh, deficiency that I have to address. I, I don't know what to, to make of that, but I'm gonna wait and see what happens. You can definitely see these top three leaves. These are the newer, newest leaves, are looking a lot more uh, spray. I don't know than these older ones that are just constantly flopping down, even though it's not even sunlight yet, not even getting hit by sunlight. Uh, the root system looks good though. It's definitely bunching up, getting nice and uh, fluffy down there. Uh, a lot of, I don't know why the camera won't focus properly. Uh, I don't know if I can get that to work. But uh, yeah, they're all white below the water, which is good because uh, when I had, had problems last time, it was all brown and slimy. Um, so they're definitely getting a their oxygen or at least there's no anaerobic bacteria growing down there is what I uh, read the slime is so yeah but mostly these guys doing really well coming up good I wanted to separate them into different pots uh, top up the dirt to you know change change out the dirt entirely the, the soil get a nice fresh batch for all of them and um, you know, let them grow to full, full figure. Uh, once or twice, 
these have been sprayed by rainwater uh, by accident I think my dad was uh, meaning well he was trying to water them for me when they were looking a bit dry and he put rain on these as well and then once I actually started spraying and, and caught myself <laughs> so the, yeah this may be a bit of a mess up there I think I'll have to restart the experiment but considering how different you know how uh, how full they're looking uh, when they've been on a regiment of tap all this time I'm not sure it's uh, you know I'm not sure that's the only thing that was going on here if these claims about tap water being worse are, uh, are substantial I don't know if maybe that's the US tap water perhaps the water down here in Barbados is much of a much uh, higher quality I, I don't know um, but so far they're, they're not showing many signs of, uh, of of any you know problems that you would normally associate uh, I haven't been filtering it it's straight from the tap uh, the only thing I can think of is that as it sprays into the glass that I use to water it it's getting a lot more oxygen maybe that's helpful in some way the soil maybe is trapping the the calcium the the calcite uh, the lime we have in our rock down here uh, I don't know I'm just speculating all right well that's it I gotta feed the cat before she gnaws my foot off so yeah over and out for now